Good morning, First Baptist Church Caldwell. I'm sorry I can't be with you this morning. Happy New Year to you. Uh, it is the last couple of days of our COVID quarantine, and so we're just trying out of an abundance of caution to keep you safe. But I did want to share with you a little bit of something you'll find in your bulletin this morning. Inside your bulletin, you're going to find a 5 by 5 by 5 reading plan. It's a Bible reading plan. Essentially, if you take five days a week times uh, 52 weeks a year, you're going to get 260. Well, there's exactly 260 chapters in the New Testament. And what I want you to do is I want you to come alongside me and to go through the New Testament this year together. The reading plan inside your bulletin allows you to read for about five minutes a day uh, and still keep up with the rest of us. It also gives you two days on the weekends where you can go back and do some reflection, maybe read some of the Old Testament, maybe read a psalm or a proverb and get a little bit of that involvement. But what I want to challenge you to do is not just be a person who reads the Bible. I want you to know the Bible. I want you to hear the Bible, understand the Bible, learn to apply the Bible. And so also, if you'll look in the lobby in both areas of the church, you'll find something called a Hear Journal Entry. And essentially, it's a sample page for you. It's a sample page with the HEAR acronym. The HEAR acronym essentially stands for Highlight, Explain, Apply, and Respond. It helps you to take the chapter that you read each day and to learn a little bit about the passage, about how it was intended uh, to be used, what the author intended, what was expected of the hearer. But it also helps you understand how you can apply and respond to that passage in your own life. You see, all too often we read the Bible as though the Bible is just a story, as though it has no great level of meaning for our future or for our today. But in reality, it does. It has a meaning for you today and for me today. And so I hope this year that you'll come alongside me and read through the New Testament together. Spend your five minutes a day studying the Word so that you can spend five minutes praying over the Word and, and journaling the Word. And then take that extra time at the end of the year, and, uh, sorry, the end of each week, and reflect back on what God has taught you throughout the week. I'm so excited to spend this time with you this year and for us to go on this journey together. Hope you'll read alongside me. God bless you. Look to see you next Sunday.